Hello and welcome back to the video. This problem we're differentiating the function y is equal to t cubed plus 3t over t squared minus 4t plus 3. So noticing that we have a fraction here, we can use the quotient rule. So our derivative is going to be the denominator times the derivative of the numerator minus the numerator times the derivative of the denominator. And this is going to be over the square of the denominator. So now that we know this, we can simplify everything. So you get t squared minus 4t plus 3. Calculating the derivative, we get the derivative of t squared, or t cubed rather. We have a power function, so you bring down the exponent into the coefficient times t, and then your new power is the old one minus 1, so that's going to be 2, plus, then we have a linear term here where t is to the first power, so its derivative is just going to be its coefficient, which is 3, minus t cubed plus 3t times the derivative of this, so the derivative of t squared, again, power function, you bring down the exponent into the coefficient, times t to the 2 minus 1, t to the 2 minus 1 is just t to the first power, which is just t, Leave that alone then. And the derivative of this, again, we have a linear um, term where t is to the first power, therefore its derivative is just the coefficient, which is 4. The derivative of 3 is 0 because 3 is a constant, so we can just leave that off since plus 0 doesn't really do anything to the value. And then we can simplify this as 3t to the 2 plus 2 is 4, plus 3t squared minus 4 times 3 is minus 12t cubed, minus 12t, plus 9t squared, minus, uh, sorry, plus 9, minus 2t to the 4th, plus, remember to Count your negatives, plus 4t cubed, minus 6t squared, plus 12t. Always forget, or never forget rather, to distribute the negative. Okay, I'm not going to distribute this out, you can do it if you want, but it doesn't really make it any easier to understand. So combining like terms up here, we have 3t to the fourth on its own, minus 12t cubed, Actually, no, not 3t to the 4th on its own, because we have minus 2t to the 4th. So combining like terms, we have 3 minus 2, which is just going to be 1t to the 4th. Just cross these off so we know we've counted them. Then we have minus 12t cubed plus 4, which comes out to minus 8, and we're adding them together. t cubed, counted these off now. Then for t squared, we have plus 3, plus 9, minus 6. We add all those up, that comes out to plus 6t squared. 3 plus 9 is 12, minus 6 is 6. For our linear terms, we just have minus 12t plus 12t, so that's plus 0, and plus 9 at the end. And this is all over t squared plus 4t plus 3 squared. This is your derivative. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I will see you in the next video.